welcome to Panda Vapes. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button so you are to the Panda Squad. And also hit that bell so you're always up to date with my reviews, unboxings, show and tells, you know, all the good stuff. You don't want to miss out on anything. Um, and if you're not new to my channel, Today we have a hardware review or a show and tell. <laughs> you know I like saying that. It never gets old for me. Um, we are doing the Boomstick Engineering Reaper. The Reaper. Yes, that is what we're doing today. We are. I am show and telling you my Reaper. And this is the box. Ooh. And it says Boomstick right there, and yeah, Reaper, and everything like that. We're going to get down to the table, and I want to show you all the inside and outs. It's already got a little build in it. And so we're going to get down to the table, and we're going to get up close and personal with it. And I'm going to show you everything about it and tell you what's up. And then I'm going to wick it and vape on it and tell you my final thoughts. So I'll see you at the table. So here's the, the the box to the Reaper um, by Boomstick. For some reason, I really like the box. I like the fun. It's just pleasing to the eye to me. And then you got Reaper right there, and you got Boomstick. Back here, you got your packaging list, the Reaper RDA, your squonk pin, beauty ring, and spare parts. And then you got your specs, and it is, it has, um, it comes with a squonk pin, so it's a MTL mouth to lung RDA for squonk mods, and it's 18 millimeters diameter, fully made of premium stainless steel, stainless steel 304. Alright, let's, you're like, alright Panda, show us the darn RDA. For God's sakes. Here's the RDA. An orange piece of paper. It's a new thing. <laughs> this is how it comes. I ripped it. Taking it out because I destroy things. I destroy things. And look at this little itty bitty thing. It's as big as my thumbnail. Well, it's a, well the, the actual RDA body is as big as my thumbnail. I'm going to get back to the RDA in a second. I'll put it to the side. And this is, it comes with this. So it, um, so you can put it on like a regular, a big, like, squonk or RDA, I mean mod or whatever. And it doesn't look silly. And so it makes it look like it fits a little better. And, ooh. Then he comes with the product testing, the qualifying, it's authenticity, I guess. And it says boomstick certificate. Everything's tiny. It's like little miniature. I really like tiny things, so this is like super cute to me. And then you even got a little tiny screwdriver, a flathead. Which is so cute, and I was really shocked to find out it was a squonk. It came with a squonk pin. I was like, "Wow, uh, it's really neat." And actually, I would think that it would work better for squonking, just because of its size. Um, you're going to be dripping a whole lot of times. All right, so you get some O-rings. You don't get a lot of um, extras. I mean, you don't get you get the normal extras. Not they don't give you like a crap load of um, O-rings like some RDAs do, which I appreciate. But they give you your just your extras. You get two of these big ones and two of the small ones. So you get two extras. Of of each and um you get some extra screws and you get your squonk pin right right, right there and um, 
pretty sure this is meant for squonking only. And I think it's cool because even though it's meant for squonking, they, they still gave you the regular pin. So you can use it for, like, I was using, I had it on here, but... I haven't really used used it. I used it, but not then I stopped using it for a while because I wasn't squonking with it. And without squonking, it's really a pain in the butt because you literally have to drip like after every vape. Otherwise, you are going to get a dry vape, a dry hit, and that is not pretty in that little <laughs> in this little RDA. So squonk if you're I mean, unless you love dripping, and that's your, like, your little quirk or hobby, you, like, you just love, you love dripping all the time, then go, go for it, but otherwise, I would definitely make sure you have a squonk to put this on, because it's just, it's made for squonking. Um, this is, it shows you how, all the parts to it and everything, I think that's pretty cool, and yeah, so... I like that they show you all that. This is pretty cool. Right here is they're they're giving you examples of how to build on it. So if you want to do it single, they're showing you how to do the single. There's two different um single diagonal diagonal coil AFC must be placed diagonally and it has like a picture right there let me see if I can get you a little closer so you can see nope I can't get you any closer I'll just push you up but you see that right there which is pretty darn cool um, that they show you that and then they say single airflow other holes are closed oh so this is if um, the other hole is closed and you just have that one airflow open um, so this is how you would build it, it's like right against the, the thing, the airflow, not the thing, yeah. Um, and this one, this RDA is really different than anything I've ever seen, like it's, I mean it's not different, but just because of how small it is, it is, it's different, you know, so it's, the whole thing's new to me, this whole, the whole situation. Um, so if you can actually do dual coils in here, which once I show you the deck, I don't understand how that's possible, but they've done, they did it and I, I guess it is possible, but I just, I don't see that work, how they did that. I wish that they would have took the cap off because they have a, the cap on. I wish they would have took the cap off and showed how they, they put them two coils in there because... It had to be really small to uh, put two coils in this thing, do. And it does have a, a squonk that is that you can get with this. That um, it goes with it and stuff like that. So and it has it comes in uh, Ultum and uh, I can't remember the other color. I have to. It's on their website. If you go to. Um, Boomstick's website, they they show you the the Reaper Squonk. I'll actually provide some pictures for you guys in the top corners, as I, or the bottom corners. However, I do it. You know, I provide the pictures of the Squonk that you can buy with it or for it, and it's sold separately, obviously. <laughs> Especially recommended for Squonk mods. Just play, replace the bottom feet, you know, they're just letting you know how to take the, take the bottom pin out and replace it with the squonk pin. It's recommended to squonk. And you would think because it's recommended to squonk, it, they would have just put the squonk pin in from the get because if it's recommended, I mean, and just have the, the normal pin as the you know the extra piece because if it's recommended squonk then it should have the squonk pin already put in there and that is everything that you get in this beauty of RDA it's all the little goodies that you receive inside it inside the box and let's get to this RDA um I was lucky enough to get this from 
because Travis won one and then then he got one for review so he gave me the extra ones so I can review it and I was like bonus score like look at that build deck it is very small so I don't get where they could fit two coils unless they're putting them over here it's just I honestly believe just I just thought I was like you know what single coil pop and even Travis agreed like single coil be the best bet to go with this and that's what we've been using single, I, don't, I don't know if he stuck to the single coils in his but I know in mine I just stuck to the single coil because it's just easier um yeah trying to make sure that metal the pin goes up really high it, the, see how the, the pin goes really high up we'll see how it vapes we'll see how it vapes with it that high all right I'm gonna actually put it on the squonker so this is what you would do you would put you know you would put this little jammy on and then I want to put the slit on because it just makes things your makes life easier and as you can see there is three air air flows there's three of them not four three so that way you can um you can either have two of them open and have your coil in the middle like mine or you can have one open and have the coil right next to the airflow if you want a more restrictive vape um you would have to move your coil closer to the airflow that way you get more flavoring and all that Look how jagged my nails look underneath my fake nails. Oh, I apologize. They look all pretty up here, but underneath they look a mess. Alright, so what I would do is I would put the lid, the cap on first. Just because it makes it easier to handle. And then you just... This is what the beauty ring is is this ultimate beauty ring right here and it just makes it look nice and I'm sure most of you guys that's been vaping for a while or you know to, that is knowledgeable already know what a beauty ring is and just makes things it makes it look have it makes it flush and makes it look nice on anything that you put it on well I mean, not nice, but it just makes it look better because otherwise it looks really silly. It's a little tiny RDA on, on anything that isn't small. And then I would take this off. I make my um, cotton kind of long because I try to fill up as much space as possible in this RDA. Plus, you want as much cotton as possible, you know, suck up as much juice. That way, you don't, it doesn't get dry as fast, but it still gets dry. It gets dry really fast. So, you gotta, that's the only thing that I don't like about this, um, I don't like about this RDA is. I'm always scared that I'm gonna get a dry, a dry hit and dry vape, and you know, no one wants a dry vape. You know that, and I don't have to tell you. I don't have to tell no one that. And you, it's this so it's such a tiny RDA. Even dri I mean, dripping. You're gonna, I mean, not dripping, squonking. You got you got to be super careful, you know. And and you know, 
with my builds and with Travis's builds, we have them low on builds, so it's gonna get drier faster. So man, see how easy it was to wick up? And obviously, I mean, I honestly do not know how they put two coils in this thing. I would love to see that. I'm sure there's a video out there that someone's doing it. Um, because putting one coil was a pain in the butt, let alone two coils. <clears throat> and that's it. And this is what it looks like on the Dot Squonk mod. It doesn't look bad. I mean, for being the beauty ring does save it a lot because without it, it looks really silly. It, it just looks really good with the squonk that they have. All right, so yeah. Uh, so this is what the um the RDA looks like. I mean, the squonk that you can get to match this baby. I mean, it doesn't. These ones, the RDAs are black, so I guess you can get black ones also. We got the stainless steel, and you can get the tops that, like, all match. This one, looks it's like a honeycomb. It's called the honeycomb version, and the night wasp, wa the night wasp, like a bumblebee wasp. Um, it's the Swedish Vapor Hive Squonk Kit with Dinky RDA. So you get the RDA with this kit which is kind of cool and it's um it runs you about ninety dollars eighty nine dollars and some change so ninety dollars oh they have all kinds of different colors so they have stainless steel they have blasted bronze and a blasted uh, blasted stainless steel oh i guess I, we got the blasted stainless steel i would like to have that bronze the um blasted blonde bronze it's really nice and then you got the rda the um, i keep saying rda the squonk right there which is really nice i actually would love to have that oh i would love to read <laughs> heaven's gift i would love to review that that squonk thank you very much send it to me send it my way i love squonks I'm big on squonking. I would love to review that baby. Yes, I would. All right, guys, I'm going to take you up because um, and we're we'll talking about the price. We we'll talk about I'll vape on it and all that jazz and everything. I like it. I I really would love to review that squonk that it come that's it's made for because that thing looks pretty cool um I, i'm wondering how it fires and stuff like that if it has voltage drop or anything like that so but yeah anyway we're gonna i'm gonna take you back up i'm gonna tell you my final thoughts and we're gonna vape on it and all that all right i'll see you up top Hey guys, so we're back up top and we're talking about the Reaper from Boomstick. And this is a cute little RDA. Um, it definitely looks better when it's on its official um, squonk that they made for it. Um, I'm just like looking at the squonks and drooling. Because you know me, I love me my squonks, and they're just so cute. Um, I think the price range is a little steep for the RDA. That's my honest opinion. Um, it's forty-five dollars for the just the RDA, and the um for the kit, it's ninety dollars, which you get the RDA, and so it's like. So it's like forty something dollars for each, which isn't that bad. But I just don't think the the RDA should be that much. Um, and in all honesty, I don't think the kit should be that much because it only takes eighteen six fifties one single eighteen six fifty. It goes to one hundred and fifteen watts. So like, I don't know. 
it kind of feels like it should be a little less. That's all I'm saying. Cause you, what ninety dollars you're getting, you're getting little, you're getting to the big coins there, you know. And it, what it's what it's made out of, it's it's plastic. So, I, don't, it's really nice. I love the look of it, but I've never used it, so I can't really judge the squonk. Um, just by look the I just think the RDA itself I don't think sh should be forty five dollars I think it should be like thirty dollars twenty five dollars that range because it's I mean it's a little RDA you're not getting um the you're not getting a big well you're not getting yeah you're not you're gonna you're gonna have to squonk with this because otherwise. It's it's inconvenience. You're gonna have to drip every time you vape, um, and it's it's just not adding up to me. Now, if it was um, twenty five dollars, I would definitely be like, yeah, that's a great price. That's actually a good price. Thirty dollars is actually, I would still pay thirty dollars, but um, the price that they're asking is. It's just too much. I just don't. I don't see it, and I don't know. Um, it's not an if it, it's not a regular an RDA. You're not getting all the stuff that you would get with a big RDA. Where you know you, I don't have to drip every time I vape in this. I can carry this around and you know take it with me out, and it's not going to be inconvenience. I'm not going to get a dry hit from this. And I'm not saying just because I can see through it, like, I'm, even the drop, like, you, you're, you're getting, you can carry more juice into it, you know, it holds more juice because of the bigger juice well. This is, like, really tiny. It doesn't take a lot of, it's not a lot of material. The, it does have, a, it has good flavoring, it has good airflow, it has all that, but I just don't think it's the price, I think the price point is a little too steep. And it could be just because it's it's brand new. Um, prices always do they, they go down eventually, and you probably could find it cheaper somewhere else. But I'm talking about Heaven's Gifts, and for Heaven's, I think Heaven's Gifts is just a little. It's they they need to lower their price for the RDA alone, because if you don't have a squonk, um, you're gonna have to buy a, a squonk. So now it's you're running your pockets up, you know what I mean? If you don't have a skunk, you're gonna have to use that as an RDA, and it's it's not built for an RDA. It's tiny, and it's you're gonna have to drip more often, and you, you, there's chances of flooding. It's just a lot of it's a lot of inconveniences when you don't have a, you don't own a skunk already, and not everyone owns a skunk. Not everyone squawks, you know. Um, so I think they should just lower their price. But besides that, that's like the only con I have. Besides, is the price range and suggestive con is that if you don't have a squawk, is that you're you, you have a high chance of if you don't keep checking it to get a dry hit, um, because how tiny it is and it only can hold so much juice, you know. Um, but besides that, I think it's amazing. It doesn't, I haven't had a leaking issue using it. I have not had, um, I've had dry hits because I haven't, I didn't, I used it as not a squonk. That's, but that's my, that's user error. I should have paid more attention. And they, they even tell you it's, it's for squonk, it's made for squonking, not for a regular RDA. So that's user, user error. Um, but, yeah, besides that, it's amazing. I think it's a great little RDA for what it is. I would not think something this small could have as good flavor as it does. And it has decent clouds. Like, it, it satisfies me. You know, I love my clouds. So, <laughs> if it doesn't have good clouds, it's out. <laughs> and it has good clouds.
of course, they're not, like, gonna be, like, ba-boom, because, like, look how little this thing is. <laughs> but, the, I mean, for I wasn't even expecting it to have that much clouds for being how tiny it is. And it's really easy to take everything apart so you can make sure, you know, your cotton's wet and everything, but... That, that's another factor that you have to take everything apart to check it if you're not this is if you're using it like I'm using it right now because if you're not using it as a squonk you this is what you would have to do so I definitely a hundred percent recommend it I think it's a great RDA now do I think you should have to pay that the price that they're asking no um I just wouldn't I wouldn't pay that much money for it because I don't even think the drop was that much money, and that's a fantastic RDA, um, and it ha it's more material, it's more metal, it's more everything, and I think the drop was like thirty five bucks. I'm pretty sure, and this is, I just think it's way overpriced. Like, well, not way, like ten dollars overpriced. <laughs> um, so they definitely need to just lower that price other than that i love it i think you should go get it it's something that you should definitely have in your collection and if you don't have a squonk get you know get the rda and then save up for a squonk because you're not going to want to use it as a regular rda that's another thing for the price point it should be lower because it's not it's not realistic to use this as a regular rda you're going to have to use it as a squonk so, I mean, like, as a squonk RDA with a squonk <laughs> mod, um, I'm totally confusing myself. But, yeah, so you, you're you going to have to put out the money to get a, a squonk mod if you don't own one. So, because of that, they should have definitely made the RDA cheaper because you're going to want to go get the, the, um, the mod that comes with it, you know, or... Or a, a squonk, you know, whatever. So, this is my only con is the price. Um, but, yeah, I like it a lot. I, it's not something I want to to use every day because, only because I'm not used to using little RDAs like this. So, it's just not in my daily, like, realm of using this RDA. I mean... I just gotta get used to it. I gotta get used to using something that I would have to put put a lot of attention to because you can't just like have it sitting and then take a vape out of it. You have to make sure that it, it's got juice in the wicks and all that because of how tiny it is. Because that dry it is not pleasant, <laughs> okay? Because I had like three of them and it was not nice. This is so good. <laughs> yeah, so I, there's not much I have to say about the Reaper. It, it is a really good RDA. It has great flavor. Gives you decent, uh, good clouds for the size that it is. And um, if you don't have it, you should ha it, it should be in your collection. If you're, if you know, if you're like me, I love having. Like, I, I'm a collector, a vape collector, so I love having different RDA, different type of RDAs in my collection, and I'm happy to have this in my collection, and thankfully, I squonk, so I had a squonk, and I definitely am eyeing the squonk that goes with it, because it is something that I definitely want to review and try out, because I know people that are interested in it probably want to know how it works is it good is it worth ninety dollars and all that and i wish i would i would love to be one of the people to let you guys know my opinion about that <laughs> um so yeah i definitely think you should run out and go get this if you can afford it get it if you can find it cheaper you know make sure that it's a trustworthy site and it's not you know some site that you don't know because it's not you're not going to get anything you're going to get beat and you might as well spend extra money and get it from a trustworthy site rather than getting nothing at all and having to call your bank <laughs> um i've had 
them situations happening a lot lately. Um, so yeah, I give it a thumbs up, and I get, I definitely give it the panda approval. <laughs> so if you don't have this in your collection, go to Heaven's Gifts. I'll leave the link down below so you can purchase it for yourself. And of course, you're always welcome to go search for for somewhere else if you see it at somewhere cheaper. Usually, like Breezy and stuff has stuff more expensive, so I don't know. I haven't really looked at the prices at other places. I just, because Heaven's Gifts sent it out to us, so I usually just recommend them because they're the other ones that sent it to us and you know gotta represent the people that sent it out um yeah so that is my review this is gonna be a very short one but a good one because there's nothing bad I have nothing bad to say about it it's just something that you have to get used to if you're not used to this little REAs it is something you gotta get used to and but the flavor is great and the clouds are good so it's good to me <laughs> and I'm looking forward to trying out that squonk definitely it's probably gonna be have to be something on my birthday list just a little hint hint my birthday is next month the 14th all right guys I hope you enjoyed this review I sorry if my mood is like a little low I'm not feeling too well I have been ill lately so just bear with me I'll be back to normal very soon hopefully um but I will see you in the next review and I'll check you out later if you haven't already please hit that subscribe button and also hit that bell so you're always up to date with me and don't forget to hit that like button because it does help me a lot with YouTube it like lets them know that you enjoy my videos and like puts me in, in like the ranks or something I don't know there's all kinds of stuff changing with YouTube um also it lets me know that you like my review and it gets and I can keep doing what I'm doing and also share so other people can see my reviews and you can get me out in the world <laughs> alright guys I'll check you out on the next video See ya. Bye.